How many times have you done this? I don't know, like 10. <laughs> really? Yeah. On all your buddies' cars? Our buddies, our cars. Have you done it on your car before? Yeah, I did it on, I had a, a 71 C10 Chevy that oh. I did it on. So right here, Cam, if you wanna get this. This is what that 12 millimeter holds into the diff. What is one, that, what is one, that? One on each side, I don't know what it is. Unless it's for the speed up, speedometer. I'm clicking time. Okay. Yeah, this fool. We have six axle bolts on this side. Hold yeah, on. Six axle bolts on this side, six axle bolts on this side. A mounting bolt here, a mounting bolt here, four drive shaft bolts over here, and then one big bushing yeah. bolt here. Right there. Stop right there. Go down some more. Is there a hose clamp or not? Yeah. Then put that. That's all it's on. No. Alright. It's free. Oh shit. I'm off the jack. And it's don't move the jack. You guys are crazy. It actually wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. But you see where that net line was? I would have never got that bolt. Uh, this one I could get to. I couldn't get to that one. So you couldn't weld a diff with it in the car. You'd definitely have to take it out. To get, if, that, if this vent hose wasn't there, then you could. Yeah, but it's there. You're right. I, and I think it'll be better to... We could take it over to Justin's now. Yeah. With a good welder? Because he's got a uh, bigger one. So uh, we can run hotter. Okay. Okay, so bring the jack out. Start going tap a -roo. Tap, tap, tap a -roo. I'd hit that lip that way. No one ever changes diff fluid. Nope. Nobody ever does. Unless it's black. That's the, and it's the fluid that gets the hottest in your car out of all your fluids. Really? Oh, that smells crazy it too. Smells delicious, huh? Mm. Who knows? Wow. What are you welding now? So can you can you point it out? I need to pull the middle part out. See those gears inside there? Yeah. Grab that flashlight. It's a limited slip, so I'll have a spring. Yeah, no, I know that. But usually the hole is bigger, so you can get weld right there. You don't have to take anything apart. So what you're welding are those gears inside here. Still weld them, but. Probably gonna Diff out, headed to Justin's house to use the welder. Can I get a good donut real quick? What's happening? Did Harley run out? That's right here. Oh. You done this? No. So please tell me this is not out of your 350. Yes. Welding it. This hole. Nothing like wait until this hole. The last minute. We got two. Those their dog. ideas. It's Tanner's idea. He's got confidence to get this done. Okay. Oh, we need to get diff fluid too from. He already, already has some. some. Oh, okay. Tanner's ahead of the game right now. All right. What are we doing? So we got to fill this hole up with welds. Okay. The holes here. So there's four around the side and I think four in the center. You gotta fill it up with welds. Mm -hmm. Just gotta weld that solid inside there. We watched some kid on YouTube did it. It's been holding since March. Cool, let's do it. Because <laughs> for some reason, Cam's car has this weird diff. Like you know how a Chevy diff has like oh, the big open. opening on both sides. There you go. Oh, perfect. So you just gotta fill that whole thing in. Yeah. Not like all the way flush, but you want to weld where those spider gears are to make it solid. I thought he was about to close, we'll close his eyes. We'll give oh. everybody a shot. <laughs> it doesn't matter, huh? Like where you do it? Now you just want to make sure there's something solid around 
both of those gears on each side. And you want to connect them? Yes. Yeah. Flip-flops is probably not the best idea. Well, Trevor would do barefoot. Oh, he's still barefoot right now. What? It's a big old glob of metal. Big old glob of metal. Well, it's a lot more solid than I thought it'd be, though. If we use my welder, dude, that would be like disgusting. Oh, the, the gas is a big plus. Yeah, it's tight. Oh, there we go. Trevor, hold that light there. All of that, right? Oh, wow. Money. That look pretty good? Them spin it or what? Yeah, we'll fill this one next. Just that groove. Where? Right there. Is it hot? No. So just like right here? Basically, just follow that up right there. Right there? Yep. better for her. If we get this back together. Fun. Justin's having too much fun. <laughs> <laughs> I like destroying all little stuff. Oh, oh sorry. Good. Sick. It doesn't spin. Yeah. Yeah, so you have a touring edition. That's why you have this weird limited slip compared to the other ones. Do it? Mm. Yeah, I'll work. I'll burn it. <laughs> Kimball, how many times have you done this? I don't know, like eight or ten? <laughs> I think. Is there I'm more not, holes to do? Unlike oh, a yeah. track car, you want you wouldn't want a limited slip, right? Kansas hillbilly style. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> is, is there any other way to do it? What? You get a haircut, Tanner? To do this, to get this result? Yeah, yeah, I went this morning. You can get a spider gear, right? That's what it's called. It's called a mini spool, but I don't know how a you would spool. put one inside this, unless you take everything off and the gears pull out the other side. I have We're no idea. Made. You have to buy a whole new dish. Can you can give it a whirl. What do you guys do? Just, I mean, I Put welded it. on like a, two pieces of metal together, but nothing like this. Let's let it cool down for a minute. Yeah. Uh, nothing. That feeds the wire? Yep. Okay. So stick it in there. Uh -huh. What I did was basically you see, see those two like gear things right there? Uh -huh. So start kind of at the bottom uh -huh. and just kind of go back and forth with the thing and work your way to the so, top. So if it's like this, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to fill it up yep. all the way in? Exactly. Okay. And then oh, really? yeah. I went down kind of in the bottom and then just started kind of filling it up like this. Okay. And then until you get to this side, then kind of do the same over here and then make sure they just go together. So as soon as I touch this to the metal, it's going to start going, so then I feed more wire slowly. It won't start, it won't start doing anything until you pull the, to pull, until you pull the trigger. Get back, it's like... Alright. What a rip. Once you, once the yeah. lights up, it starts burning, then you can see.
it grinds every time. It doesn't matter what you do, how you press oh, on the man. clutch, it can wait super long. That was pretty bad. That's what I was telling you. So, he has to fight because... I mean, it's not pretty. Look, look, look. Guess what? <laughs> You're never going to see it. Oh, my God. It's because you're bouncing around. You need to make, make sure you keep contact with that It looked like wire. it was building up faster. I couldn't tell with the not least light yet. Don't move it fast. Oh. You got to go slow. Oh, I thought it was like building up fast. Oh. I was like, oh, crap. You're, you're, you're making a puddle and dragging that puddle. Yeah. All right. You just go slow around and it'll... It just, you're just shoving stuff in there, so it doesn't really matter. It's your diff. You're ruining your own stuff. Just know that. <laughs> what do I do about this? You're good. How do I... Just stick it down just, in there. Stick so, yeah. it in there and just... That looks way better. That's pretty dope. Solid. You gotta do a few things like getting better. Should I add more? Yeah, fill more on the top side and drag your puddle across. Yeah. Yep. So where you have that big bubble right there, uh -huh. just kind of take that same height that you go all the way across. All right. Around our this? block. I'm gonna hold it, do this corner of the side one. See how you're on that side? Flow it all the way down to that bottom edge. All right. Get all in that area? Yeah. Okay. We good? Go for it. get this back together get the old gasket off tanner's got a razor blade we got some brake cleaner and the put back together process begins trevor's using a little razor blade handle tanner you're working on some high temp what is that called our jb weld silicone gasket maker sealant I will, I'll leave a link in the description to all these tools we're needing. If you guys were to do this yourself, I'll put a little kit together in the description. Tanner, should I take out all this gray stuff in here? No. Sure? Yeah. If not, this is well. Way. This is good stuff. Good. Dropper. Perfect. All the diff bolts back on. Tanner's putting the gear oil in it. Don't fill it all the way up. <laughs> That's your fill in sight. So when it starts spewing out of that hole, you're full. But you could fill from that venting hole too. That takes forever. I thought you'd fill them all the way up. Mm -mm. Yeah, because it's got to have room to spin the oil around. Kind Inside. Of, and it will expand here. Yeah. How much is left in that book?
Oh, <laughs> 